I'm here in uh, Murano now in August in this intense heat and uh, doubled with the intense heat of the furnaces, so it's really, really hot. And I'm working on um, a special project for um, uh, Berengo Studios for an exhibition that will take place in September uh, with women artists working in glass called Unbreakable. Working with glass, it's extremely rapid, extremely fast. And um, we have to be attentive for all moments. Um, you have to make decisions really, really quickly. And uh, I like that. I really like to be under pressure and uh, to respond to uh, the maestro and uh, to understand where he's going with the process and to be able to intervene just at the right moment. I really enjoy the process of working with the maestro. This experience of sharing and knowing where to stand back and knowing where to intervene and this kind of really fine balance. And, and I guess this happens in this, these split seconds that you have in the furnace where you need to make a decision and uh, understanding exactly where you can, where you can uh, where you can put input, where you can provide input into the process. This new project is um, is based on drawings that I made in March and in April, so during the lockdown in Paris, where I'm based. Um, it was a really, really intense period, of, a period of questioning uh, um, under the extreme conditions of the confinement that we were, we were all undergoing. And I was thinking about projects that could somehow um, relieve the, the stress and uh, the fear uh, around the pandemic, the COVID-19 pandemic. So I began making drawings of masks and thinking about this um, false reality, uh, the experience of living through this very strange situation. And then this mask would be a way of protecting yourself and hiding yourself, concealing yourself, but at the same time revealing a, a new kind of identity. So this project is really a really strong project for me and really particularly related to the, the pandemic. And I'm not sure that I would have done this project had it not been for the, for the, um, for the situation that we're living through now.